Hello guys, welcome back to another YouTube video with Tank Reaper on Ark Survival Evolve. That's right boys and girls, we're back on Ark Survival. Uh, this is actually, believe it or not, this is actually episode 10. Uh, yeah, but I have some good news. I know there's a spot, I, I built a trap um, of where the AI-30 Xenosaur is, but the sad news is that it's going to take a while for me to get probably back home, uh, back to main base. And also, I don't know if you did recognize, but I do have some of my dinosaurs kind of missing uh, over there. I only have two dodos over there, a, a Morphodon and my most traps. Uh, that's because I took some more dinosaurs back to my main base, so that way they could be more safe. But the third Xenosaur is somewhere over here. And I am also sorry for uh, last night, even though last night was Friday, for Sunstrike Fridays. Uh, I just couldn't get on with my friend, and we're not going to be able to make some Sunstrike Fridays until January 5th. Well, actually, after January 5th, I guess. Actually, no. I forgot when near January 5th, but January 5th, after the New Year's and stuff, that's when I could go back treasury trying to make some sun strike videos but for now you are still going to get some arc videos and some world of tanks content and I thought this is in so over here but yeah you still will get some arc videos and stuff like that level 45 top draw I need to tame one of those why does it have to get foggy for? But yes, I know that we didn't do did Sunstrike Friday. Uh, I do have some other news though that I want to sit here and talk about while I'm trying to look for this Therese Xenosaur. Like it was here, it was a level 55 or something like that. They went down to the beach. Um, but the other news is that uh, on Thanksgiving Day, uh, there will be no videos on Thanksgiving Day um, because I'm going to take a little break on Thanksgiving Day and then videos will resume after Thanksgiving is over and then on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day I'll be taking those two days off along with another four more days off of making YouTube videos so you will be getting daily uploads until Thanksgiving Day and then it will resume back to be normal after that, and I can't find this freaking thing in the store now. Schedule trike. Good XP and good bounce as well. Let's say, uh, where is this thing in the I really don't want to run into it by accident. Like, it's so foggy. It was up here. I know it was up here. I mean, I know this world don't be active when you're not on it. Hmm. That's weird. I'm trying to fly low to the ground so you guys can see it. I'm sorry if there's too much fog and stuff. But yes, uh, like I said, was saying though, guys, that we are probably going to take a little bit of a break and stuff. Well, I guess one here, just get some metal. Uh, break from, uh, you know, doing a few things and stuff. Oh yeah, I love to do this night. I should. Oh, I know you've seen a lot of narcotic berries in my inventory. Because we are going to need some metal though. Cheeky little dead Morphodon. I'm trying to attack. A hundred, three hundred. I'm probably going to dump some of that meat off my RG though. 
I thought this was going to be a taming video, but I guess not. I guess it's a metal harvesting video. I mean, we are going to need a metal. How much metal am I going to get out of this rock? I know I put the harvesting amount up pretty good. Another 300. Another 100. Let's dump some of this, because I don't want to dump the whole inventory. Because there's other things in his inventory that I want to keep. Like some of the uh, loot. I mean, I could probably take some of this loot out of his inventory. Like those RG crawls, I do not want to throw those out by accident. I I'm going to keep the hide because you never know when you can. I just throw some hide. I mean, yeah, okay, I guess it's fine if I throw some hide out. It keeps it not meat. Uh, well, that didn't went the way as I planned it to. I mean, I was also going to try to release a arc video last night, but it was just things weren't going my way either. Okay, good. I just got rid of something I kind of didn't want to get rid of. Holy! Well, why there? Let's kill you, so wait. Oh, you have a buddy. Oh, you have a friend. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, does freaking three of these guys watch the freak? Okay, that's just. Went completely not planned. Uh, there is this taming video. Apparently, this was supposed to be a taming video, and it's come to becoming a more not a taming video. Oh boy! Ah, but there. I want to keep that actually. To be honest, uh, I want that spoiled meat because I'm going to need that to make a lot of narcotics, um, so I, I could tame a Rex. I don't have a lot of narcotics. I should be having a lot, but I just don't have a lot at this point. Uh, I'm actually going to keep that. Uh, all this I'm going to keep. I'll uh, get rid of that. Uh, i get rid of that too. And that. Get rid of those too. Oh wait, what's one of those? Oh, I'm going to kill myself if I keep that up. And if I do find a third, a third Xenosaur, I'll be definitely kill myself with fall damage. Something I really don't want to do. There's one in the freaking tree. Oh, it was in the freaking tree. Was that the skin for your helmet? I don't remember. Don't think so. I can find it. That is the skin for the, of the trike. But where's the Rex one? It's I don't know. I guess I actually lost that one. Oh dear. <laughs> well, we are well. It's not foggy that much anymore. So I guess we could go back out looking for a third Xenosaur. But let's get a little bit more metal over here. We're going to need a lot of metal. Uh, especially if it comes down to, well, you know, we're just going to need a lot of metal. For one, we're going to need to tame our, well, not tame, craft ourselves a Rex settle. And how much metal can I freaking get out of this rock? And also craft a few other additional things as well. Uh, we are going to need to craft. Ah, there we go. My Arjun can carry all this, which is excellent. Let's go down here to the river. Well, that, I guess, that, I guess we're just going to have to think of finding our uh, Therizina sword here, guys. 
The plan was is to tame a Thera Xenosaur, but well, apparently this one either despawned or something happened to it. Uh, oh wait, I think I just freaking found it. Is that the Thera Xenosaur level 20? No, that's not the one I was looking for. The one I was looking for is literally a level 55. And we are going to have to kill it, so let's kill this one. Well, th I guess this video was more of the harvesting metal. I mean, I'm not complaining about the metal resources. So I just went down to eat this corpse yet. It was up here. Huh. That is very awkward though. Now I guess instead of taming a freaking Thera Xenosaur, I guess we could tame a Tech Parasaur. I mean there's a lot of them. All over the place. I mean there's a lot of Parasaurs all over the freaking place. But I'm just gonna check this in case if I can find another Thera. Like that's one of the goals that I set myself to, to tame a third Xenosaur. I guess if we don't tame a third Xenosaur this episode, I guess we'll just build, start building our house then. Um, I really do want to tame one, but if there is none near, nearby, then I just can't tame it. I mean... I've been so hungry. Even if I can find a fucking tech vessel too. I might just do a dino wipe between this episode and next episode. Actually, I'll probably definitely 100% do that. I'll probably do it after this video is over so white dinosaurs can spawn in. What level are you, buddy? Uh, level 18. I I kind of want to get something a little bit higher than at 18, maybe 20 of a tech parasaur. Um, yeah, I guess I can, but that trap for nothing then. Well, that kind of went disappointing. Like, for real. Uh, the, the whole reason this episode was supposed to be a theory, but I guess it wasn't. I guess it was more of a metal run on this episode. Trust me, we're probably going to do more metal runs in the more further future. Because um, we are going to need a lot of metal. Two for one, we're going to need it to craft ourselves the industrial forge, um, the grinder, if we want to use a grinder, which I kind of do. Um, and just a few other things that we're going to need a digital forge for. Even to make a saddle for Rex we're going to need metal for. Um, but once we get the industrial forge the smelting of metal will be a lot more quicker and don't have to wait as long with the forges that I got. Um, I mean I could probably make another two more for the base at my main base but there is no house so I guess I might as well start building a house next episode so that's probably going to be what's going to happen next episode is that we're going to build a house and stuff like that um, because I can't find no more 30 Xenosaurs right now and between now and next episode um, also we'll be having should at least have the house going to be building on the next episode or actually not that uh, can't find a tech person now. To take it home. But I guess what I'm trying to say is from now to the next episode guys, I guess we'll try to do a few other things. For one, I'm gonna try to get my dinosaurs over back over at the new base and also maybe even get all my stuff and the soldiers over to the new base as well. And also do a dino wipe. Um so that way new dinosaurs will spawn and at higher levels too so that way I can find at least a few dinosaurs that's a more higher level that's something that I kind of want to do and be 
before I do forget, there's actually explore note. Where is that? I shouldn't be able to take a bird down here, but oh boy, I uh, hopefully don't get stuck down here. Okay, <laughs> that kind of got me afraid there. I kind of get a little dark in the game. But there it is. Okay. Get the XP. I mean, also, they kind of spawn to the air a little bit, do they? I wish I could do that one thing that you can do on PC though, is to allow hibernation of dinosaurs to not happen. Um, that's a real helpful thing, uh, because that means dinosaurs will not hibernate while you're flying around. So meaning they will be always active um, while you're flying around. But that's my PC thing, so sadly. But, no worries guys, I might be getting one pretty soon, maybe this Christmas I'll be getting one, and expecting videos out of it, probably not right away, maybe, I don't know yet if I'm going to be getting two screens right off the bat, but I do know I'm getting one, so expecting maybe behind the scenes with Tank Reaper Part 2 after Christmas is over, maybe after my few days off, then we'll do a behind the scenes with Tank Reaper. Um, because that's something I do want to kind of do. Uh, I should be bringing up freaking a few dinosaurs over back over with me. I'll probably do that in my own time, like I said. Yeah, I'll do that in my own time. But like I was saying, that expecting that and stuff like that. I know this might seem like a little bit of a boring episode. I'm sorry for that too, because it was meant to be a taming video, but apparently that fairy dinosaur had other plans. And I don't understand why. I'm just keeping an eye out just in case if I do see something. But I don't see hardly anything. I guess this will be a metal run, guys, so that's probably what the video is gonna be called. A metal failed attempting a failed taming run, but metal run. We'll probably call it that. Something in that area, we'll probably call it and just call it a night. And because I don't want you guys to be seeing me flying around in the dark and flying around. I'm trying to find a fucking 30. That's what 30 spawns very rapidly. Like, what? Why am I not finding too many dinosaurs in my world? I'm probably definitely going to have to do a Dino Wipe for the next episode, though. Hundred percent going to have to. And I'm going to cook myself more meat. That means I'm going to go out there and kill some things, I guess, more meat and stuff like that. Oh, that's a very dark area. Let's go see what's in this fire drop over here. I had the base. Hopefully it doesn't despawn before we get over there. It has it has a health. So it's pretty strong. Wood, stone, thatch, fiber, and flint. I guess I take those materials. I usually dump them out because I can easily get those materials, but eh, uh, it is what it is, I guess. There's a core bind right there, but that's n again not what I'm looking for. If I can find another Therizinosaur up here, that would be freaking wonderful, but I hardly doubt we're going to find another one. Tip. 
Parasaur. At level six. Sorry guys, if you guys cannot see what's going on, I'm trying to get a fucking tech parasaur. There we go, we got it, we got it. We're gonna take this back to base and tame it. Uh, simply because, well, at the tech parasaur, we're gonna to need to get these guys. We're gonna to need to find a female. So basically today is not a fully failed attempt at taming something, so yeah, it's still going to be kind of a metal run, but also taming a tech parasaur. I hope you guys are still going to enjoy this video. Because once we get back to base, we can easily tame it, and it will be in our base, and we don't have to worry about fucking bringing it back home. Because <laughs> it's right back at home. I'll probably drop it off somewhere else, so we know my dinosaurs do not attack this thing because I don't want them attacking it and killing it. So all my dinosaurs are put on pass, not passive, neutral. Please don't come over here. I know something you're probably saying, but thank you, got a parasaur. Yes, I got a parasaur, but this is a tech parasaur, and with a tech parasaur. I could breed them, have the babies, and basically, this does sound very fucking horrible, I know it does, but basically kill the younglings and freaking have uh, some unlimited, uh, what's it, materials? <laughs> uh, I'm having a brawn moment today guys, so please don't hold me against what I'm trying to do today. Uh, Elmet Dust. That's right, Elmet Dust. And I can't put that in there. I'll just put my truck. Yeah, as you see, I have my truck over here too. Took me a little while to get this guy over here. I actually put my narcotic berries in here. He has a level. Let's see, does think that level. My dodo has a level as well, which doesn't need that level to wait. So I can move my little weight machines. Trying down over here. Level 242. Weight. Because he needs to carry more weight if we're going to use him. I guess this is just a video that explains why we didn't do a sun strike last night. I, you know, I have also have family coming over. That's the reason why I won't be doing much of uh, Sun Strike videos until January 5th. But I hope you guys understand the reason why and stuff. Uh, for You're going to be tamed pretty soon. But yeah. We got ourselves a tech parasaur, guys. We got ourselves a tech parasaur. It's a level 66. Oh, never mind. It's a level 98. Not bad for a tech parasaur. And also. Why did I do that for? Look how beautiful this beast is. Beautiful. Just beautiful, guys. But, I think that's going to be wrapping this video up, guys, for now. And I hope you guys did enjoy this video, even though it didn't seem we, we did much in the way of actually just taming this beautiful beast behind me here. And also getting some metal. But, from now to the next episode, I'll be doing a dino wipe and also uh, bringing over my remaining other dinosaurs over to this base. And then next episode, we'll be doing a actual house because I don't want to be living on it. freaking just a little bit of like three structures so yeah next episode will be that I do hope you guys did enjoy this video and like always please press that thumbs up and yeah and subscribe to the channel guys thanks for watching see you guys next time bye for now